Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my week 35 update of my fitness journey. I'm coming at you with my wet hair, semi-wet hair, again today, and my favorite Disney t-shirt that I wear like almost 24-7. It's so comfortable and I don't need to like dress up or anything. So like normal, I'm just gonna tell you what I did this week, then we'll get into my updates, and then we'll close off with the photos. So starting off on Saturday, I didn't do any Anything. I don't do anything on Saturday because I take the day off. Sunday, I did the 15 minute intense workout. Um, it's like the HIIT workout, it's 15 minutes. And then I did the water bottle arms. I swear that one gets me every time because I do it and then I wait like a couple weeks and then I do it again. So I don't constantly build my arm muscle. I just think that I forget about it. And that workout is actually kind of challenging for me. And then I did the five minute daily stretch and I like that one it's really short it's not very intense at all it's just to do something you know I just didn't really feel like working out this entire week so I don't know it's just been an off week when it comes to like eating well because I haven't had fit life foods in two weeks now and it kind of sucks I think this week I am going to go to fit life foods it's just with our schedules and everything I couldn't really like fit it in to get it so hopefully I'll get back on the swing of things then on Monday I didn't do anything because we were on our staycation so I wrote down that I walked 3.5 miles that day because that's still something. I was on my feet, I was walking around, so I don't know if you guys wanna count any of that, but I count it as something. And then Wednesday, I did the day six workout and I kind of forget what it includes. Let me look it up real quick. So day six of the 45 minute sweaty hard plan includes the eight minute six pack workout, the 10 minute hit workout, and the Jason Derulo, that's the one I chose to do, and the silent cardio workout. And let me tell you, that was really difficult. Um, I felt kind of sick to my stomach, not gonna lie, during the whole thing because <laughs> I just felt kind of sickish that day. Like my stomach, not necessarily anything else. But um, during that whole like Wednesday, I was just not feeling it, but I was like, I have to do something. So I just, you know, pushed through that 45 minutes just to get a workout in. And then Thursday, I didn't work out. Tuesday and Thursday, obviously I don't have any footage because I just chose not to work out. And then Friday, I did the 45 minute live stream video and she does live sometimes on her YouTube channel and it was so funny because she forgot that she was gonna do the five minute stretch and then she's like oh she like closed out the video and everything and then she comes back and she's like I forgot the five minute stretch um, I will have the thumbnails on all of the screens so you guys can see exactly which plans I followed um, but the 45 minute live I highly recommend I love that workout today it wasn't too too difficult it's definitely for medium advanced level but I certainly loved it and I felt really good because I really didn't feel like working out today um, so I was like you know I'll just do this one long video and it is for medium to advanced level so I was like okay I'll be at least doing something and I love working out with Pam it's one of the coolest things because I feel like she really like pushes you and she just kind of her voice is kind of relaxing so even though you're kind of dying on the inside you're like I can do this because Pam's doing it it's live technically not really but it was awesome doing that workout and I felt so good after it moving on to the updates I'm just gonna flat out say it this week is not my best week at all I honestly wasn't even going to work out this week but something inside of me just was like you know you can do it Alex I also got some cute new workout clothes I will post a picture on the screen right now but my sweet cousin Perry gifted me some Fabletics activewear to try out and it's really cute the leggings are super comfortable it really holds in your gut for the price it's really good quality like i was really surprised but i just wanted to thank perry for gifting me those because it was really sweet um, I will do a video on the set um, probably in the near future, so be on the lookout for that. Um, but overall, I'm really pleasantly surprised about the quality of Fabletics. But yeah, I guess my main 
thing this week was that I did not feel like working out at all. Maybe it has to do with how I've been eating since I haven't had like my fit life foods. I don't know. Maybe that's just psychological. I just have been really like blah and my time of the month is coming up. And as you know, if you're a girl, you know, you just don't want to do anything when it's leading up to that time. So I don't know. I just not wanted to do anything and I've been completely unmotivated. But the funny thing is after I work out I feel great So that's one thing that keeps me really motivated during you know the time of not wanting to work out and everything But I still have one more wedding and I want to look fierce for that And then I actually am considering taking a week off of working out just to give myself some time to relax and have my body just take a lazy week. Let's move on to the photos. The photos aren't crazy different. I actually might look a little bit more bloated, like I've gained weight, but whatever. It's life. So this is the front view. Um, Alex on the left is last week and Alex on the right is this week. Here is the side view of that. It's pretty plain, simple. Got a little pooch there. <laughs> and then moving on to pre-workout Alex. Pre-workout Alex is on the left and current Alex is on the right. And then here is the side view of that. Yeah, I'm just feeling like a potato these days, so I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. Question of the day, how do you stay motivated to work out? Somehow I just have it in me that I, I don't know, if it's in the routine and if I've got to do it, like I will. Um, there's only been one time in my life that I've actually procrastinated on a big project, which maybe I'll save that for a story time, but... How do you stay motivated? I would love to know. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.